You underestimate me. Dickie. Can I call you Dick? Cute. There's this new piece of legislation out. It's called the Constitution. More cute. I'll win this. Lindsay was our Harvard law student. And what we were looking to accomplish with that character uh, early on in the series is to juxtapose the actual practice of law against um, the promise of what law should be as told to an idealistic law student. Professor? I suppose I should be flattered that you've finally taken an interest in tort law. I would never have expected it, given your fetish for the Constitution. I'm up against you. And she probably thought that she'd be in a big law firm, um, big high-rise, you know, high-powered attorney. And here she is with Bobby. And she's got her little corner. And I think that she's trying to figure it out as she goes. She's very green. I mean, she's really by the book. We don't have the experts lined up because we couldn't afford to hire any. We don't have the science on addiction because we didn't do the legwork. We're going with nothing because that's what we have, nothing. And you're throwing me this case, not because of any confidence, but because you don't want to be the one to take the fall. Lindsay, to me, was the character who always was fabulous. She's a very, very bright woman. And I think the character's intelligence, you, you, you feel. U.S. versus Nielsen, 10th Circuit, 1993. Officer smelled burnt marijuana. Car search, OK. Trunk, not OK. U.S. versus Seals, 5th Circuit. And here, you really wobble. He not only went into the trunk, he opened a container. Chadwick? We've all read that one. Lindsay. Oh, great. Why do I always get the drug dealers? Never mind. 